Well, I'm still trying to make my way through this game. I am not alone in not having finished it, although most people have. Uh, I have a few YouTube channels, gaming channels that I, I follow, and two of them right now are still playing through Sekiro, but they play other games, or they are playing other games while they're playing Sekiro. So, you know, that's the reason that, reason that they're taking longer to get through it. I wish that was my reason for taking so long to get through it, but, you know, it, it isn't. I have acquired uh, all of the prosthetic tools. I have quite a few of the skills uh, that I've been playing around with, and that's helped. I mean, I'm not finding the combat quite so restrictive, but it's still restrictive enough that, you know, when I think about playing the game, I'm like, oh my gosh, I don't know if I want to. I've gotten hung up on a couple of bosses that I, I really felt, you know, with each one of them, that that was going to be the breaking point for me, that I was not going to be able to beat them and progress in the game. So uh, that's, that's been really rough for me. You know, having played Bloodborne and the Souls games, Anybody that has, you know you don't have to worry about getting stuck on a boss. You know, you can take your time with them, you can push yourself to the point of actually feeling broken, you know, uh, and having to accept that you're not going to be able to do it on your own. But you don't have to do it on your own. You can get help in those games. And because that's not possible uh, with Sekiro, you know, I've really gotten myself psyched out over it. Uh, so when I got hung up on those two bosses, you know, it, it just, I thought, my gosh, you know, I've tried so hard, I've gone so far, this is going to be what's going to keep me from finishing the game. No, it wasn't. I beat the boss. Well, this boss is going to be what's going to keep me from finishing the game. And then I, you know, anyway, uh, the castle is under siege. I've been dealing with that, uh, getting to this uh, this particular chained ogre, uh, the, you know, this one has red eyes. I beat him. Uh, I did, and I used I used a save file to redo the fight because after beating him, I opened the uh, the door at the other end of the room, and I found the ninjas that I had been dealing with, you know, getting to the castle. Uh, I found them outside, and I had thought to myself. I wish I'd opened the door before the fight uh, was over because I, I, you know, of what I ended up doing when I redid the fight. I thought it was funny. I was kind of silly and I'm trying so hard to, uh, you know, add some things to this game that just kind of playful and make it a little more fun for me. And again, not that it hasn't been fun, but anyway, that's all.